we're going to draw Magic Carp. So I'll give a shout out to Magic Carp. Although I would rather eat fish than draw them. So I'm going to start off with a really big fat fish shape. I'm leaving room right there. Okay, we want to do a little hiccup here and then continue to that point. Now I'm going to make the lips, which are just like two raindrop shapes. Okay, I'm going to come from underneath the fish lips. This far, I'm going to skip a little bit of an area. Keep going. Skip there. Come up to here. And now we're going to go out, flare out for the tail. Thin. Okay, so this is going to look like a great big skinny C. Letter C. All right. Okay, now from this hump on the head, we're going to come down. We're going to skip an area and we're going to come down that far. There's a second line on Magic Carp. So we're going to come there and then we're going to come down here. Okay, under these lips, there is a line and it's parallel. Skip there. It comes and it meets this line. We'll start under here and we're going to make it wavy, just slightly wavy. And then there are two lines coming from the fish's body out towards to the end of the fin. There's a side fin and we'll do that. I'm going to start about parallel to the lips, the lower lip. And I'm going to come up in a curve and come right back down. Then I'm going to run the line parallel right here and all the way back. Now this lower part is pretty much a straight line. And rather than wavy, this is more of a, a straight edged fin. But we're still going to divide that into three parts by putting two curved lines. Next, we're going to make something called barbels. And these are actually sensory uh, receptors for fish. And they're usually located close to the lips. We're going to make scales on the fish. We'll start behind the head and it's a loop, but it's a squared loop. There are two more fins on Magic Carp. One is like a crown. It has three points. And the one on the bottom has four points. I'm going to take a, something round and make that big old fish eye. What worked perfectly for the eye was a nickel. I'm going to start coloring. I'm going to color the body of the fish orange. Manticarp's lips are pink. The upper and lower fins and barbels are yellow. This is a very light gray colored pencil and I'm going to shade the inner part of the tail fin, this part right in here of the side fin, and kind of a triangular shape inside the eye. A little bit of shading goes a long way. 
So, here is our magic tarp. I'll see you next time.